Alright, in the corner stretching. I just did lower body medium, which is I did front squats, glute bridges, leg extensions, seated bent leg calves. Um, it's a medium day, so I did like six to eights on all of them. Check it out. Alright guys, so starting with front squats, um, I did a set at 140 and then I did six more sets at 135. Um, all of my exercises will be like that. I have a uh, an RPE stop point that tells me when I, uh, when I, I guess, complete my first set and then I drop back a certain percentage for my remaining sets and I continue until I hit an RPE stop point. Um, I'll actually link you guys to a video um, of my leg, last leg day when I was in Corpus where I kind of explain um, what I mean by those RPE start and stop points. Um, the only exercise I did not do that on though are these, my glute bridges. Uh, this is only the second time I've ever done them. Uh, last time I just did like eight sets of eight with like 95 pounds, just learning them. Uh, this particular day I did six sets with 185 because I felt a little bit more comfortable with them. Um, but this is the only exercise in my whole program that I don't actually use the RPE start and stop because um, it's new to me. So I want to be safe and all that stuff. Um, leg extensions. I did 120 for a set and then 110 for six more sets following that. Um, again, I'll link you guys to the video that kind of explains what I mean by these start and stop points. My whole program is RPE based. Actually, you know what? I'll do a training. I mean, yeah, I'll do my next video. Probably I'll include my training split. Um, and then the last of my four exercises for this day were uh, bent leg calves here. I did 105 for a set and then four more sets at 95. At the end of this, I'll actually tack on um, text as to what I did. And I'll also link you guys in the description box to the video where I explain this RPE based training and I will uh, I'll do a bit on my training split in its entirety pretty soon here guys. Thanks for watching.